Patrick Ewing is extremely underrated historically, in my opinion, and here's why. First of all, Patrick Ewing's numbers were absolutely incredible. The man was so reliable and so great for so long. First 13 years in the league, 20 plus points per game, and then in his prime years, I mean, absolutely amazing offensive and defensive stats. And now, of course, it's time for the one elephant in the room with Patrick Ewing, the one blemish on his resume, the one reason I think he's not a top 20 player, not an inner circle Hall of Famer, it's because, of course, he never won a championship. But I want to counter that with these couple points. First point, it's a question. Did Patrick Ewing ever play with another truly great player? His second best player most years was either John Starks or Allen Houston. These are very good players, but he never played with another player that averaged at least 20 points per game or a Hall of Famer in their prime. So yeah, I gotta just give Patrick Ewing so much credit overall for handling the New York media market as well as he did and playing so well for so long without much help. 